them pull up your both the people. They're both brand new, so we don't have a lot to say about them, probably. Well, I mean, we can say a lot about them because they have images, they made quotes, uh, they both generally seem to be excited for this because they're both in the Discord, chatting away, making sure everything's set up. One of them even, like, logged in to make sure it worked instead of waiting exactly, like, you know, before the give game, before, you know, after the give game to have the problems. That's, exactly. that's, that's key commitment. And we appreciate both of these players. I know, no issues in the IRC, it's, it's, it's awesome. I think that the uh, putting it on the website the way we have has made things a little bit smoother for new people. It only took <laughs> a bit long. <laughs> we could have easily done this, this in any long. previous year, I just never thought of it. This was in, uh, <laughs> it was embedded in the actual speedrunslive.com website, I just don't know what I was thinking. Alright, so now, now the big question here, is it... Kitty E cat, or is it Kit Ye cat? Or is it just Kitty cat with an extra E? But... It could be just Kitty cat too. I'll probably end up just saying Kitty cat because that's a little bit easier to say. But this is uh, a, a match between two first timers in MT: uh, Kitty cat versus Palm Horse. Kitty cat rocking the Hollow Knight image, while Palm Horse is rocking an image. I'm assuming that's one of the, the My Little Pony characters, but just like artistically and they're like caravanning across a river. Oh yeah, and looking at their flavor text, uh, Kitty Cat doesn't read on-screen instructions versus no. <laughs> Please read the instructions. <laughs> uh, regardless. Uh, I can't... I'm either like... Okay, so it's backwards or something. Doing things backwards. Uh, but that's said forward. But Okay, we got there. I thought it was some Ibsen Lorem stuff. Like someone just Ibsen Lorem their uh, flavor text, which... You know, it's a very funny choice. But yeah, good times. Uh, if you're hanging around in the mystery Discord, uh, we've got the advent calendar. Today has been Lawnmower Day. I know we talked about that. We saw a lawnmower earlier today in one of the games. Maybe we'll see another lawnmower appear that you could make an easy submission for the advent calendar. We we saw a game earlier with a lawnmower in it. Um, that was Frogger 2 Swampy's Revenge. Yeah, I, I had already submitted the other PS1 Frogger game. That's also in a really early level, so that makes sense. Uh, and let me tell you, it's bad it's like at least the frogger 2 game has a like a plot and like kind of a through line i really the like first... the ps1 frogger game actually i have nostalgia for it i played it a lot as a kid um I, it has the same terrible hitboxes uh and but instead of like the the five frogs you need to find being in like you know a set path they're just randomly around and you have to search the entire map to find them the later levels of that game get so hard. I think we've got somebody on an ultra wide monitor for this game, which is exciting. <laughs> Ooh. Fun. Yeah, uh, RPG Book Club. Uh, also, if you're in the Discord or new to Discord, every month slash two months, we do have an RPG that a group collectively plays. Berserk, if you could post what that game is, because I can't clearly see what the actual game is. Uh, yeah, I can't easily see what it is right now. 
All right, that is a na that is a title that I am definitely going to butcher again because I'm very good at saying words. Madu, nope, I've already messed it up. Cool, Exuno says the Puyo Puyo RPG. Wonderful. That's the easier way to say it. Oh yeah, yeah, I know about this one. Yeah. Uh, it's short, so if you have time between finding advent calendar games, I'm just looking for something fun to do. If you give that game a try, if you have time we'll between be anything at all, you are testing video games. If you're me, <laughs> that's the rule. <laughs> <laughs> that you mean you're testing that game? You could just test that game for an extended time. <laughs> yeah. Hmm. I wonder if this is going to be good. Why don't I keep playing? Now this, uh... You had a thought there, and uh, I was waiting Sorry. for it to finish. I'm, I'm like... also just getting the games ready for people. Uh, yeah. yeah, you want to do... This person, this person's new to OBS. Sorry, I, I gotta tell him. OBS no, no, stuff. it's it's fine. It's fine. It's just like you start a sentence with three words that doesn't finish at all. And I was like, oh, "Are you just dramatically pausing? <laughs> Do you not know the next word? Is it rude to just interrupt? Am I?" Yeah, I, that's just kind of a thing that I do, um, and there's <laughs> nothing I can really do about it. At this point, but we've been it's... doing this for like what? I can't remember how many times we've done commentary together, and like I'm used to it, <laughs> but I still make fun of it every time. I, well, it's it's hard if I'm also getting the game together. We got new people, you know. They have they're not used to OBS. They're not. I'm not that good at OBS, but maybe I can help. I'm streaming I, I right just, now, at least. I think. I just fixed an OBS issue on my end because I've been using my OBS to capture some Wii U games and wii games that i actually physically own to take pictures of because those consoles don't have in picture taking mm. and every time my obs opened it kept telling me it didn't shut down correctly despite me like clicking the nice things to close it down couldn't figure out why realized oh maybe if is there an update that's not happening and that was so far the issue it was just an invisible update that it didn't tell me about. Yeah, streaming is fun. Oh well, yeah, this is the second day of Mystery Tournament 18. We just started. We've had a few matches so far. Deadlines are in the challenge. I think we have at least a good amount of time for round one. So get your matches in. We don't want to have ID forcibly come to your house, knocking on the door, just saying, hey, get your match done. He knows your time zone. He I'm will find you. I'm deceptively fast. Uh, yeah, I'm running. I'm going to try to get him. <laughs> I'm going to get you, make you play I'm just your gonna... match. <laughs> Like, do not call ID at 3 a.m. You know. Oh, yeah, this is the it's ring fit? <laughs> wow. I should play more of that game again. Here Ooh, we have a game. We've got a, we've got a game. We've got a demo. Uh, so I. At least I. Oh, I it's think this it's game. Demo. That makes me think it's actually just free. Hold on. I do recognize no, not, this game. No, it's not a demo. It's just free. It's just free. Oh, it's just uh, free. I, Perfect. I gotta fix that. I got confused. I recognize this game, but I haven't played it. Uh, so the game is called Snake Force. Uh, fun goal of beat normal, badass, and FPS modes. Yeah, so basically we're going to be playing the same... Uh, levels three times in three oh, different okay. ways. Um, the first mode is going to be by far the most challenging. And the next two are kind of a victory lap, but you can do some fun things to try and speed them up. 
So it's, it's going to be an interesting optimization race in a sense, at least for the second and third parts. Exactly. Well, and especially the third part. You'll see when it comes to it. Um, you can get you get kind of a clue <laughs> by the name of the mode. But um... yeah, uh, I'm assuming FPS stands for first person shooter, but yeah. maybe it stands for something else. It's true. You never know. You never know. All right, I'm gonna kind of turn the rain wave down. Turn now, chat. If you could decide what FPS up. alternately stands for. Feel free to post that in chat right now. I'll read out the ones that I think are funny. First person snake. Which, that must exist, right? Oh, yes. A third person shooter. Like that. Uh, frame <laughs> per second mode. <clears throat> so it's just one frame per second. So what the frame heck? No. Per second mode. <laughs> why, why did it say? <laughs> it just... It just... The guy... Oh, no. I just... Thought, I thought it was gonna start and then okay they're back they're back I just I clicked dot done and then all of a sudden has left the IRC I'm like oh no oh no <laughs> please don't leave um badass could also be an acronym uh so if you have a good uh, acronym for badass uh also post that one in chat too But like going off of the little game image, I can already this, kind of assume what's going to happen in this game. This was on the discovery queue that we streamed last time, although somebody oh, it suggested was. it. It was a chat suggestion, but still, um, it got tested by somebody and submitted by someone else, or probably the person who tested it. I mean, it says Freeball, so it was submitted by Freeball, and we're off. Okay, so Kitty Cat already with the advantage of True. waiting right next to Mission 1, as opposed to Palm Horse, who kind of started a little bit back in that menu. Uh, Palm Horse, although, is smart enough to not shoot the people that, uh... Oh! <laughs> so, here's how this game works. When you shoot, everybody shoots. So if you're standing in a single-file oh. line, everyone will Oh, they shoot behind you? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> So, um, you have in the top right, where it says target, you need to get a certain number of guys to the end of the stage. So, yeah, uh, I mean, okay, I'm, I'm... I think it's a very cute concept. Yes. So, uh, this one says three of two. You're allowed to accidentally kill one of your guys in the first stage. You can actually turn friendly fire off. And if you did that, I don't really understand why you would be playing this game. It kind of has nothing <laughs> at that point. Um, yeah, I mean, it's it, it'd be easy mode for sure, but... Yeah. You know, both of our players are on the second level. Uh, how many level? Do you know how many levels are in this game? Maybe seven or eight. Not a lot. Okay. Oh, I didn't so start the it, timer. Shoot. So it's, it's going to be a short, shorter race. Yeah, this is going to be a shorter race for sure. Um, Which you know, for for two new players, I mean, that is kind of a nice thing. Uh, yes, sir. We've we've also we've had so many first timers playing games that they shouldn't be playing for their first race. <laughs> Kitty Cat's being a little uh, little rough with things. Um, we've got so yeah, this is a strategy. You can leave the guys uh, stranded on the ground until you come back later after having killed things with fewer guys because it's just kind of dangerous to have so many at once really easy to friendly fire um that was what i ended up doing for some of these harder levels i just kind of went through and cleared some stuff out before going to collect people but it's true we did have first game play but that was pretty tough um yeah i, I remember that one went to time but nice and palm but yeah palm horse got the, got the one level lead now yeah um, we've got 
New Zealand flag, and I'm not familiar with what Palm Horse's flag is. Um, I, can, I can tell you that it's abbreviated PS.SVG. I'm not I'm not good with flags, no, so I'm not gonna attempt. I'm not even gonna attempt to guess. Oh, Palestine. Oh, yeah, that makes. Yes, sir. Like it looked familiar, so mm -hmm. I was like, oh yeah. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, the little guys will talk to you. They say yes, sir. Wait, Kitty Cat's back on level two. What is this? I don't oh, think no. Kitty Cat Kitty Cat was always finished. on level two. Yes, right. Palm Horse yeah. was the one to finish. Okay. Yeah. Kitty Cat had an unfortunate uh, death. But yeah, the, the tricky thing here, just lining up your guys to shoot in a way. Yeah, Palm Horse, I don't believe has enough bros. Bring, bring more bros. So the level will end if the bros don't exist. Um, oh, so uh, if Palm Horse actually explored the level a little bit more, probably could have found more bros. Yeah. Um, I don't think that that's in the Does it say that in the pacement? It's not, I don't it doesn't think say so. Okay. But you kind of right, just so th figure it out when you lose really badly and then the level just ends. Oh, is there some sort of slowdown mechanic? There is a slow so that's a... I had forgotten so that, that that existed. I don't think that it's particularly useful, but it's probably not very hard to program. <laughs> so, yeah, because uh... I'm seeing on uh, Kitty Cat, uh, they are most certainly yeah. using that to their advantage to not lose bros and accurately shoot their shots. Yeah. Oh, yeah, here, I'll get this pace bin in here. Yeah, it might not be the fastest strat, but it is a consistent strat. And sometimes consistency is the fastest strat. But that is Palm Horse with another level cleared. So on to level four. And we've got little jump panels. Oh no, you left your go you, you left your <laughs> bros. Yes, sir. You can go back and get them. I, I Honestly, think it might be... thinking, let's just worry about those guys later. You yeah, also can't die. Main... You know, they're trying to shoot you. Yeah, if your main guy gets killed, it's you're, you're just done. There is no uh, ranking officer situation here. <laughs> no, no. You can't uh, just give your command to the second in line. They don't know what to do if you're not around. Oh, it's so it's just basically Pikmin, but with guns. <laughs> well, this is supposed to it's gonna fill that void of Pal World, I guess. Nice, dropping the barrel <laughs> down there. Oh, somebody died. Sometimes it's kind of hard to tell. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Kitty Cat has the line of bros. That would be pretty good if everybody had names, Exuno. I agree with that. Like in uh, Patchwork Heroes in our last top eight. Be like, no. Has, any has anyone seen a Seppo? <laughs> it's like a Seppo has died. Kitty Cat kind of just going through, taking these guys out first. All right, this is the end. Going back and getting the bros. Uh, so, fun fact for you Advent Calendar participants, there is a red exploding barrel in this game. Oh yeah, and this is free on Steam, so... So there is a free entry for you, uh, for the first person who wants to claim it. So is the way that this works is that if they do Snake Force for that now, you can... Oh no, uh, so yeah, someone already claimed it. Yeah. Yes, sir! Yes. <laughs> Before I even looked... I, I just thought, no, yes, someone sir. has already claimed this. Just as, like, yes, within the first minute of Frogger 2 that we had earlier, someone claimed the the lawnmower. <laughs> but both of our players now on the same level. Palm Horse yes, with sir. the stage knowledge, but 
Kitty Cat does have an advantage knowing how to use this slowdown. I think Palm Horse might know. Well, maybe not. It's just choosing not to. Um, this is definitely the kind of game where I could know the slowdown exists and forget about it. Yes, sir. I believe they're on the same level here. Yeah, we can tell. Yes, they, uh, they are on the same level. Oh, just... no. Palm oh, Horse. No. Lost... <laughs> these this these horrible platoon units just have escape. no intelligence. They will follow orders 100%, even if it means jumping off of a cliff. Always. Palm Horse Dedicated is soldiers. Now. Okay, so Palm Horse does now know the slowdown, and is starting to use it. Yes. No, I think so. I think what that was was too many bros dying, because I mm -hmm. I I don't think anything happened to to lead bro. Yeah. Now Palm Horse, I think, just discovered this slowdown, because now they are using it. This level, you know, demands it. Kitty Cat. It has the lead now, so there's been a lead change. Needs, Needs more to bros. Go recover another bro. Um, there's three of four. You notice it's hard to see because of the aspect ratio of this game with on this stream. But if the text is red, then it's not good enough. Oh, there we go. Help. That might be the only one that Kitty Cat needs. Oh no, <laughs> Kitty Cat! Why? Why? <laughs> You just going through the motions and you're not thinking about it. Oh, that's so sad. <laughs> sad, but also very funny. I feel so bad for left player's name. So it looks like the bros can actually take. M oh, <laughs> rip, bro. The the bros can take a few shots before they actually do die. I think yeah, it's two or three. It's a couple. Um, yeah, there's like no way to actually like tell. One thing I want to point out is that I don't think you have to kill all enemies. Like, if you want to just walk to the end, you can. Um, these guys are pretty it's... aggressive. It's difficult, but in certain yeah, situations, not... you might rather just leave some people alive. And of course, paying attention to Kitty Cat has made me not have made me miss Palm Horse completing that previous level. So Palm Horse has taken back the lead. Yes. Yes, sir. Uh, this level has some pretty thin paths you gotta walk. Oh no! Got in a single file line and lost a couple of guys. Cost of doing business. Collecting that bro. Needs five yes, bros to finish this level. I think that's the most so far. You really, they really have to climb this tiny plank. You you can walk is... in a straight line easier than it seems because it's uh, like keyboard controls. Okay, so normal controls. Okay. Yeah, yeah, exactly. <laughs> oh, sneak it up on this guy. They'll never see him coming. No. <laughs> All right, Kitty Cat's got the clear. So both of them are back on the same level. Got the steam achievement noise. Okay, we are on the iPad. I think it's an iPad. <laughs> uh, it's clearly an I. Yes, sir. What yes, was sir. the H stand for? Oh no! Got the, the I leader stands right for at injury. the end of that level. The I stands for helicopter, but it's that I kind of in the middle of it. Oh, oh, it's it's a silent I. No, there's an I in helicopter. It's after the L. That's no, just silent, the I though. just stands for that one. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I oh, mean, there is a one. leaving one in reserve. A, yeah, <laughs> making sure they. It's a good strategy. <laughs> yeah. In in this level, it's it's unfortunate because like, it's kind of just a long linear path. I mean, so there, there is an argument between... You're making a pretty big trek. 
I mean, there is an argument to be made to just go with the single guy and then clear out the enemies. It might be long, but you're not at risk of losing your bros. No. Yes, sir. You could still die if you got shot enough, I suppose. Like, sometimes having the extra bros yes, does sir. help because the enemies yes, do sir. take multiple hits. Mm hmm Oh, I don't think you can actually fall off of those platforms. Yes, sir. Which ones? Uh, those thin ones. Oh, really? I don't know. It was looking like Kitty Cat yes, was, sir. like, really, like... Maybe that's why it, it, it felt just... so easy. <clears throat> I mean, so like again, here, I could I would be just completely run from wrong. This guy. Yeah, good move there. With plenty of guys to spare. Plenty of guys. Oh, and Kitty Cat's even... right here, too. Oh, and there's so many more guys at the end, too. Yeah, just just run. Just run. Go up the ramp. Okay. Kill him just for revenge, but get out of here. And there's the halo of success. So, you know, Pomhor still has a little lead, but it's not as big as it once was. No. Yeah, we, we had this game. Oh, geez, big explosion. We <laughs> had a few of the bros at the back there. Um, what they get for not standing in front. Uh, oh, yes, wow. Oh, snuck in. Yes, Palm yeah. horse. Mission accomplished. That, that is, is it for normal, so we are moving to badass mode. Now we've got badass. Yes, it's yes, right sir. there. Yes, sir. Yep, hit it. Touch, the, touch it. Go, go to badass. Palm horse. Yeah. There we go. Precious seconds. Yeah. Yes, sir. Go badass, uh, so badass mode. Guessing, it's so I'm guessing it's just, just single. Yeah. Okay. Yes, sir. Which just means run. Like, you don't even need to worry about shooting. Yeah. Uh, some levels are more dangerous than others. I think uh, sometimes you ought to shoot when there's a certain number of people. But if you have obstacles yes, to hide yes, behind. Yes, sir. Yeah, and there was actually, um, there are other characters. There's like a John Wick character that has a pistol. Um, and the original pace bin says change at your leisure, but I, we wanted a lock character choice and I forgot to tell them that. So I did have okay, to give so... them a pace bin addendum, like, because the one wasn't fixed. Palm right, horse so is running cat. right through. I think it's the correct strategy. So much fab, the, uh, the newcomer who got such a good time earlier has finished. Uh, all three modes. Yeah, now it's just a mad dash, and Palm Horse is, is not slowing down. Ooh, and Kitty Cat takes an explosion to the face. Yeah, you still have to be... Oh, no! <laughs> That's not where you want to go! <laughs> Explosions happening. This is very much uh, action movie. Badass is an app name for this mode. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Um, Palm okay. Horse took a shot, but I think it's going to be clear. <laughs> it knocked him off. They got too scared. They fell off the edge. All right, level four. It turns out FPS stands for Funky Platforming Section. You're so right, honestly, in this game. <laughs> because, spoilers, there is indeed a jump in FPS mode, and that makes some of these levels pretty interesting. Yeah, Palm Horse is just not slowing down. Palm uh, Kitty Cat needs Palm Horse to just like make a mistake at some point in order to have yeah. a chance of catching up right now. But anything can happen, as, as you said, FPS Whoa, mode. look at the dodging and weaving. Oh my gosh. So we can see uh, the H HP bar, uh, kind of a circle at the top. Yeah. Oh, took a shot.
slow-mo to line themselves up. I forgot that that existed by the time I made it to these modes. Yeah, on the iPad. Dodging all these shots. I think is I think this is it for badass. No, there's one more level after this. One more level, yeah. This one is uh, the most dense level. It's not. It's pretty short, but there's a lot of people in a, like right next to you, so you might need to do a little bit of killing in this mode. Or or not. Nope. Or not. Absolutely. Oh, okay. Oh. One, two, uh, three, look four. Look at the health. Okay. That's we're it. We're good. Yeah. All right. Now FPS mode. Get in there. Go there quick. There we go. Immediately recognizing where FPS mode was. All right, here we are. And there is a jump. Oh, can you jump in this mode? Yes. <laughs> so you can really take shortcuts. I guess if uh, whichever one of them is willing to jump, I guess if one of them does and the other doesn't, that's going to be kind of a huge difference. Oh, we'll see. We'll see. Palm Horse finishing level one. Six levels to go. Kitty Cat uh, halfway through the penultimate level. Still has a good amount of HP. Oh, that was weird on Palm yeah. Horse, but... And the, and the colors has changed? What, was that like a slowdown? Or I don't know what's going on. Assassin mode. Yeah, I don't know what's going on. <laughs> Did everybody just die? Oh, there's RNG. I see. And that'll just happen. I don't think it's a massive advantage in this instance because of how far ahead Palm Horse normally was, but I could see. I didn't notice that didn't happen when I was playing. Oh. Ooh, but takes a death. That is exactly what Kitty Cat needs. Kitty Cat bobbing and weaving. Oh, go through the door. No! Ah, uh, Kitty Cat had had the completion, but just took a wrong turn. Don't shoot those barrels. Oh, no. Okay, we're good. The people look so much like barrels, it's hard to distinguish. All right, Kitty Cat taking the same path. Takes a shot, hides behind the wall, has completed badass mode. Looks like Palm Horse is not willing to jump. Could be saving some time here. I won't took a shortcut there. Yeah, a little bit of one. I mean, I'm assuming that Palm Horse doesn't realize that they can jump. Yeah. Um, I mean, that was the first thing I did, because just you press spacebar when you're playing an FPS, you jump. I'm not so sure. I mean, I suppose you could put that in the pace bin. But I also feel like that's something that you should try. Ooh, Kitty Cat knows. Kitty Cat's jumping. Yeah. Oh, that might be. Oh, but like it's it might be just too little too late at this point because Palm Horse not jumping, Kitty Cat is. Uh, it's gonna be closer just because of these jumping. Yeah, look at that. I mean, it's you can make some pretty big skips, but I think uh, Palm Horse still has it because this is the yeah. final stage here. If there were more levels, Kitty Cat may have taken it with this jump knowledge, but I yeah. think it is just... Yeah, it's just a little too late, because that is the completion Here from Palm go. Horse. Has entered the final ring, and that should be a dot done from Palm Horse. <laughs> we get to see Kitty Cat on this victory lap here. But honestly, very close race. Mm -hmm. Kitty Cat's going to finish, I would assume, in the next minute or so.
I'm assuming Palm Horse has dot dunned. Yes. Or they have a different name in IRC, but yes, they did. Then hit that dot done on the timer here. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry. Let the people well, I know. Did, I did start the timer late. Let's see. The actual dot done time is 22.30. Alright, final level for Kitty Cat. This one you this can jump. really be yeah, skipping. This one, I'm just assuming they're just going to jump. You can actually do it, Wake. You can jump straight over from the beginning and then jump over the wall and finish this level in like yeah. 30 seconds. <laughs> There it is. GG, that is the that finish is from Kitty finish. Cat. Very close race from both of our first-time time racers, but it is Palm Horse who does take the victory today. Yeah, there's a free game. This is kind of all there is to it. I mean... This is a game that has a very fun concept. It would be nice to see this get a little bit more expanded. For sure. Um, absolutely. I think that that would be... I, I think that this game could, could serve a little bit more. I mean, I'm not sure exactly where like, they would take it, but you could do some pretty complicated levels. Especially with, like, the fact that they have an FPS mode to have, like, two different designs... Yeah. to make it some levels more challenging in FPS mode. And have like some of those that do have those skips that you could clearly see. Like there's a lot of cool design uh, perspectives or just like opportunities there for some very fun level design. For sure. I'm going to see if uh, either of these new people want to do an interview. Oh, look, Kitty Cat is already here. Move to stream commentary. Hello. Can, can you hear me? We've been saying Kitty Cat, Kitty A Cat. You can tell us. We cannot hear you. Yet. It might be the, the classic default mic setting in Discord that loves to just reset your mic. It happens to me constantly, and I'm doing this all the time, and it still messes up all the time for me. Yeah, anytime Discord has an update or Windows have an update, it just yeah. really messes with the audio setting. So always a silly time technology. I know how that is in the meantime while we're waiting for that to happen. This is our last match of the day, but I want to just let us tune in to what's coming up here. Yeah, unless someone else has a sneaky, unassigned time match that they want to... Oh, hello. Oh, there we go. Hello. <laughs> Sorry about that. How you guys doing? Good. Good. Uh, welcome. Uh, sad to say that you did not take the victory this time, but how did you enjoy the game? Uh, it was really fun. It was... I thought it was going to be easier than it was when I first loaded in. Like, I've played a bit of that type of top-down shooter, bullet hell type stuff, and I was feeling pretty good about it. And then all my dudes shot each other in the back <laughs> and died. <laughs> if it makes you feel any better, Palm Horse did the exact same thing. Yep. Welcome, Palm Horse. Uh, congratulations on your victory. Yeah, they're muted right now, but, um, yeah, no, I mean, this was, uh, this was quite a match I sh uh, on the shorter side, and this is all the game has to it. I mean, it's a free game, and this is just, this is it. Not too many levels, and you ended up playing them, you know, all of them three times, but Scrambles and I were just saying, we could see this getting expanded somewhat, it being kind of a full game experience if they fleshed it out a little bit. Yeah, I liked the idea of the the extra modes like i i think the pace been telling us that you don't actually have to kill all the people in the mode that says kill all the people um 
was definitely helpful. Like, <laughs> yeah, it, it would have uh, taken a lot longer if I actually wanted to shoot everyone. We actually added that after the fact because when you when you start it and it says kill all the people, um, I'm just <laughs> I was like, well, do you actually have to? And then I tried not doing it, and you didn't have to. And I was like, well, we since the game literally tells you you have to in that first level, I think it's just still yeah. there from when it was like giving you a tutorial, but it was confusing for sure. Yeah, no, I, I 100% would have stopped and killed everyone, I think. <laughs> um, right. But yeah, then it just turned into running and jumping. Yeah, uh, you actually were the only one uh, of the two of you to actually jump in the FPS section. I, I thought it was worth a shot pressing the spacebar. Um, and it turns out that you can jump, so it's pretty yeah. fun. Like we, we, we theorized if there were a little bit more levels in this game, it may have actually gotten a lot closer. Uh, it, it was still pretty close. Yeah, we were only a minute apart, I think. But um, yeah, the space bar kind of trivialized the third section because you could just jump over the bullets. Like they don't change their aim at all. Yeah, I mean, like it, it completely changes everything that you can jump. Yes, yes, absolutely. Like, it, all of the level geometry and, like, the obstacles and everything just become irrelevant. Like, even the jump pads that they give you, you can just jump over the gaps. Yeah, it looks like um, Bomb Horse doesn't have that mic going, but uh, congratulations on the win. It was pretty close. I think that maybe if there were more levels, uh, since Palm Horse wasn't jumping, you know, you could have definitely seen a comeback there. Um... Apparently, there's some sort of... Uh, we probably won't have this one in again, because uh, according to someone in chat, and we did see it happen once, kind of like more than halfway through a level that Palm Horse was playing in badass mode, where all of a sudden all the enemies just disappeared and the screen went red and you just like walked to the end. It's like an RNG thing, I guess. Um, but luckily, they were already pretty significantly ahead and it didn't have... Who, oh, everyone dies and assassin spawns in and he's super powerful. I see. Well, that's just weird. That's too bad. We probably won't have this game in again then because that didn't happen to me at all when testing or anyone else when testing. But um, luckily it didn't affect this race too badly. Uh, but yeah, cool concept. This is one of the, my favorite things about mystery tournament is just uh just finding out all the cool little games that you can find online um and weird yeah I, re games. I really enjoyed it if you just i think it was the first race for both pom horse and me yeah yeah uh so congratulations on getting through your first race joining irc no problem it's always difficult and you guys had no issues so congrats <laughs> it's a great thing i did a I, I did a practice one yesterday just to make sure That'll do it. And, uh, yeah, uh, you are both still in it. Double elimination tournament. You're, I'll look at the bracket real quick. Since TPC isn't here, I, I, uh, they're always, well, if the bracket loads, Chalange <laughs> seems to be offline. <laughs> so I would look at the bracket, but you'll be going up against somebody next and it'll be exciting looking forward to it all right uh i'm 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 chatting with uh palm horse in a in a text chat right now oh got it uh, just because they can't get their uh audio client to work because you know discord uh so just kind of dming uh says howdy howdy had a lot of fun with that game uh, i thought at first it might be easier just to kill everyone and then go back and get the dudes you know, but that turned out to take too much time yeah, yeah, I, I thought the same thing because it was much easier to shoot people in real time rather than use the um, the the like slow time function. Yeah, I, I noticed Kitty Cat, you kind of clued into that slow time a little bit faster, and then I think you abandoned it near the end, where Palm Horse didn't use it until near the end. Oh, um, see, I couldn't I couldn't keep my dudes alive without it. So like that first level, I was trying to just run through and shoot people and all my guys were dying and it, yeah I, I figured 
using the slow time was a bit slower, but it meant that I could actually shoot people with yeah. like one or two bullets. Yeah. yeah. And Palm Horse saying, uh, when you had too many people, it was impossible to get a good angle. The slow time function wasn't much use, really only used it for positioning. But most of the time I was dying, it was really more of a positioning thing and not a reaction thing. Mm. Yeah, yeah, it's a weird... Um, I think going... I did that for a couple of... Like, a couple of the early levels, you could just kind of run through and kill everything and then come back. But then, like, that one with the little thin, like, girders that you're walking across, that would take forever to walk back to the beginning. That level just gives could, you, like, 12 guys right at the end, though, so... The, the could you fall off those calm. girders? Like, I, it looked yeah, like... Yeah, definitely. You could, okay, you can. It, it, for some it's, reason, just like part of the the animation made it look like you were just locked in the girder, but you could still fall off like the side of like the actual stage. They were directed so that when you're in top down, was the like you just hold two, like you hold W and A, and it would go at exactly the right angle. Um, so you like unless you let go of either W or A or like S and A, you just couldn't fall off. At least they were kind in that way to put them at that exact... Because I remember looking at that and immediately thinking, oh, this is going to be horrible, but then not really falling off of them. So I, I I like that they thought about that kind of thing. Yeah. Uh, Palm Horse saying, uh, I didn't realize until partway through that the platforms didn't have invisible walls around them, so you could just drop down. Uh, so yeah, we saw uh, Palm Horse, uh, at least in the FPS section, was just kind of dropping down. Uh, you could jump, uh, but if you didn't realize you could jump, that is a, also a great yeah. alternative strat. On the final level, you can actually jump like to your right, and then the goal is right there. You can finish the level in like one second, because <laughs> you could just jump over the walls. Oh, of maybe, maybe they I didn't, didn't think, think it that. through really <laughs> when they were putting it together. Maybe they just thought it was fun like that. I don't know. Maybe it's some sort it of. It definitely felt like if like the the two alternate modes were not how the game was designed. <laughs> no, you know? no, for sure. We had to put them in just to get a little bit more content out of this game, though. Well, um, thanks so much to both of you for playing. It was a good match. Um, as we see, one we final see thought from though. palm horse uh oh, so that weird screen thing that we saw uh uh palm horse thought that uh the game was crashing when that happened <laughs> it seemed uh, like it so, was going to like what was the explanation there that we got it's just because of the some randomized mode of sps mode yeah some sort of assassin will spawn but they just spawn behind you so like it's not a big deal because they you're faster than they are anyways. I, I don't know. I guess it's just complete RNG. I didn't even know it existed. It never happened when I was playing the game, and it didn't happen to... Um, it didn't happen to a kitty cat. So no. just, <laughs> just unique to you, Palm Horse. But yeah. at least... Like, it was one of those things where if that happened to you, Palm Horse, and it caused... And it didn't happen to a kitty cat, and it caused like a... it, it We would have probably thrown out the results to this race. Yeah. Definitely. In this instance, it was probably, I don't know, it's probably about 10 seconds and it was already looking, there was a bigger split than that. But I, I it definitely is a, <laughs> it's a wild thing. I was like, what is going on? Someone in the chat said assassin mode. I said, I don't even understand what that means. What's going on? Um, I mean, that's, that's the, that's the joy <laughs> of the mystery tournament. Sometimes yeah. we'll also be surprised even after thorough testing. One of my favorite was when the very first race of mystery tournament was a game, uh, where you like throw your hat and you can like spawn to where you throw your hat and oh that's right it had been updated since it was tested and it just played completely differently they gave it a completely broken mechanic and made it a hundred percent easier to play the game and so uh just had to the first race which everyone was excited for had to get redrawn <laughs> the game got broken in the meantime and things like that happen but anyways, yeah, uh, well, you've been seeing this coming upstream for a while, but we've got three in a row tomorrow night. Um, nothing until then. Well, night if you're living around where I am. I imagine uh, in your time zone it could be quite different. But, yeah, thank you so much, uh, Kitty Cat and Palm Horse, for the match. Both of you are still in it. Thanks for joining this tournament for the first time. It's always exciting to see new people and 
I think with that, we're going to take off. Thank you, Shrambles, for commentating with me. Yeah, uh, thank you. I'm just going to check. Uh, Palm Horse, do you have anything else to add? Uh, he says he's looking, had a lot of fun. Looking forward for the next one. Well, uh, so congrats, Palm Horse. And Kitty Cat, you're not out of the tournament yet. Uh, we do have the back half of the bracket for you to make a fun push. You know, we always love to see someone in that uh, lower bracket make an incredible run to possibly make top eight. Yeah, that was, that was super fun. So looking forward to it. All right. Goodbye, all. <laughs> <laughs>